That's right, buddy. This uh, fall, we've brought back our election series, Coffee with the Candidates, where we get to know the candidates running for office in the upcoming election on just a little bit more of a personal level. Joining us this morning is the current, former current tre treasurer and now Democratic candidate for Rhode Island's second congressional district, Seth Magazine. Thanks so much for coming in. Great to be back. Thank thanks, you. Thanks for uh, you know making some time for the road show this morning. You know we've been doing these segments for for a couple of weeks now, just you know trying to get uh, get to know everybody a little bit better. So when where is your favorite spot right here in the Ocean State because look yeah. I mean we're really blessed. We really are. Uh, so during the summer my wife and I we like to take our son to the beach. Rhode Island of course has the best beaches in the entire Northeast. Yes. Forget forget the Cape, forget <laughs> New Jersey. Rhode Island is the place to be. Um, and we mix it up. We probably go to East Matunic the most but we also love the Narragansett Town Beach, sure. love, uh, Charlestown Town Beach. So we mix it up but um, you know the beach in the summer is is the best part of being a Rhode Islander. That's right. Charlestown is a beauty. It really is. It's a beautiful place yeah. down there. And one of the other things Look, we're, we're also blessed because we have so many incredible restaurants from one end of the state to the other. When you and the missus and your, and your, uh, your child are, are hanging out or you want to go to a restaurant, where are you going? So anywhere on Federal Hill, first of all. That is that is the place that I love to go the right. most. And so, uh, you know, anywhere on Federal Hill, I'm not going to pick favorites, but that's, that's my favorite. <laughs> Good move. Um, but, you know, if we want to go someplace a little quieter, if it's a date night or something, uh, lately our favorite has been... Um, uh, Place called Tate's in Wickford. Okay. Uh, it's uh, it's a good kind of hole in the wall Italian place, and so that's that's where we go for date nights. And Wickford's really just it's yeah. a Wickford also is a, is a beautiful place too. So as you know, calamari is the official uh, state appetizer. We've got the coffee milk drink. What are some of the favorite things that you like to have? To eat? I mean calamari for sure. You know seafood again. Seafood in Rhode Island. That's that's the way to go. Um, so. Yeah, my wife and I, we do calamari. Our son, Max, is one year old. Mm -hmm. He just had his first clam cake the other night. All you right. should have seen his face, the way he <laughs> lit up a, a Rhode Island boy having a clam cake for the first time. Um, but, you know, seafood in Rhode Island uh, obviously is the best. Yeah. And so that's that's our go-to. And you really can't beat, beat that stuff you hear from everybody. Around. All right, now, do you have, like, when you do have, like, 10 minutes or yeah. just some time to chill, do you have any hobbies that you yeah. like to do? So lately, as a new dad, you know, yeah, that, yeah, that's, that takes that's probably out the window. Yeah, but, but it's great, right? I mean, we're having a great time. My, my wife and I were first time parents. Right. Max just turned one a wow. few weeks ago. And our thing is, I, I take him to swim lessons every week. That's our bonding time. Um, and uh, he is, um, you know, he's still small. He's, he's not as experienced as some of the other kids in his right. swim class, but he's always the most enthusiastic. He's so <laughs> excited to get in the pool. He splashes. He's playing with the other kids. And that's also our bonding time. And even when things are very busy, on the campaign or in sure. the office, um, I really try to protect that time um, as, as bonding time for me and him. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, that it all goes by in the blink of an eye, and you're going to be like, "What you know? What yeah. happened?" So enjoy that. Enjoy that time. What are some of the other? You know, that we have so many like little hidden places here in Rhode Island, little, little hidden gems. We like to call call them. Where are some of your favorite places? Yeah. So um, the other thing that my wife and I like to do. Um, is uh, we go to breweries, right? Oh. And uh, yeah, because we've got, I mean, we've got great breweries in yes. Rhode Island, which is something that I think that's sort of a well kept secret because we know that in Rhode Island. Right. But people, you talk to people from outside the state, they don't necessarily think of that. But you know, you, we, we go to Whalers, we go to the Tilted Barn, we go to Graysale, um, Appenog, and uh, that's that's you know on a. On a Sunday afternoon, if the Patriots aren't playing, that's that's, that's where we you can to find go. out. Yeah. Well, look out, you may be, uh, you may have Brendan Kirby hang, <laughs> hanging out with you yeah. and following you around. Thanks so much for making yeah. time with us this morning on the Thank road you show. For having me. I great, appreciate it. great to have you here. Now, don't forget, Election Day is coming up next Tuesday, November eighth.